Victoria Island Local Council recently organized the Stakeholders Consultative Forum to discuss the 2025 budget. The event which took place at the Council Secretariat brought together various stakeholders including community leaders, business owners, residents and council officials. The forum provided a platform for stakeholders to contribute to the budgeting process, ensuring that the council's priorities align with the needs and aspirations of the community. In his opening remarks, the executive chairman of Iru Victoria Island Local Council, Rashidat Adu, emphasized the importance of stakeholders' engagement in the budgeting process. This marks another edition of our consultative forum since I assumed office as the executive chairman of this esteemed local council development area. We are gathered here to apply our goals and plans for the coming year 2025. Stakeholders undoubtedly play a critical role in determining the success of any project or organization, including ours. A session like this provides a platform for the local government to engage in meaningful dialogue with various stakeholders in our community. It is an opportunity to explore possible partnership for creating an economically, socially, and uh, environmentally sustainable future. This forum also serves as an avenue to propose actionable in initiatives for the government the private sector and the other major stakeholders, including civil society. Our aim is to identify challenges, existing gaps, and critical areas where the local government that requires special attention. Together, we can propose appropriate action to address these issues effectively. During the forum, stakeholders discussed various issues affecting the community, including infrastructural development, environmental sanitation, security, education, and healthcare. The local government needs to do a lot more in the area of cleaning up the drains. They, they have done a few, but there is so much more that they need to do. This man takes Victoria Island on our head. They done a lot of roads that we cannot even expect. He done it in a vision that everybody sees our chairman. You know that he's a, he's a responsible human being. He carried everybody along. The head of planning and budget department, Boladi Adebayo, said the stakeholders were invited so that they could deliberate on the needs of the various communities and provide solutions. We call them our stakeholders, and our purpose of calling them is for us to hear them house in preparation for our year 2025 budget preparation. And in fairness, we have a large turnout of them. The corporate bodies, are so, they've surprised us so much today. We have all the banks represented, all the sectors of industries in Victoria Island were represented. This engagement has afforded them the opportunity to be part of the administration, which is the purpose of democracy. And that's why you see them in large number. If we have failed in the past years, they will have been weary. But they have believe, the believing system, the courage, the confidence they have in the administration is still on, uh, on, on, uh, very high. So that's why they are here and I'm very confident that they will give us very positive uh, contributions. I know that our people, they are Oliver Twists. And that's one of the things that I used to tell people. I said, um, government is continuous. Whatever I start this year, next year, before my exit, I cannot complete them. I'm sure I cannot complete. Because if my predecessor did everything, I won't be here today. So also, if I'm doing everything, my successor will not be able to do anything. So I will try my bit for this remaining part of the year that I'm going to spend here, months that I'm going to spend here, and I'm sure my successor will carry it from wherever I start. The 2025 Budget Stakeholders Consultative Forum marked a significant milestone in the Council's efforts to promote participatory governance and community development. Music